our tale of the tape for this heavyweight main event. It is the 39-year-old Mark Hunt opposite the 34-year-old Brazilian Antonio Silva. Six inches, the difference in height, and a whopping eight-inch reach advantage with Bigfoot Silva. To get us started, here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. Our three judges scoring this contest at Octagon side are Barry Foley, Charlie Keach, and Tom Papayano. When the action begins, our referee in charge of the Octagon, Steve Percival. And now, for those in attendance and UFC fans watching around the world, live from down under in Brisbane, Australia, it's time! Five rounds in the UFC heavyweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. A Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu fighter holding a professional record. 18 wins, five losses. He stands six feet four inches tall, weighing in at 264 pounds. Fighting out of Coconut Creek, Florida, USA. Antonio Bigfoot Silva! And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a striker, holding a professional record, nine wins, eight losses. He stands five feet ten inches tall, weighing in at 262 pounds. Fighting out of Sydney, New South Wales, Australia, by way of South Auckland, New Zealand. Mark Super Samoan Hunt! Okay, gentlemen, we've been over the rules of my commands in the change rooms. I expect you to obey those commands at all times and protect yourselves at all times. Let's have a good, clean, fair fight. If you want to touch gloves, do it now. Step back to your corners. Well, they thought about it, and finally they will touch him up. They are going crazy here at the Brisbane Entertainment Center as Antonio Silva looks to maintain his position in the top five against Mark Hunt. Obviously a huge opportunity here in the heavyweight division. And not for nothing for Bigfoot Silva, gotta be nice to be sharing the octagon with someone not named Cain Velasquez. But Mark Hunt, very dangerous in his own right, has had a career renaissance in the Ultimate Fighting Championship. See Bigfoot Silva switching stances, making absolutely sure that Mark Hunt is on the outside using a lot of long-range attacks, teeps, and stomps to the leg there. And this crowd is into the action early, supporting their guy, Mark Hunt. Bigfoot with a thwack to the outside of the lead leg of Mark Hunt. appeared to just miss the very big target that is Antonio Silva's head. There are those leaping shots from Mark Hunt. He's so dangerous and very deceptively quick. Nice combination from Bigfoot. Mark Hunt so low to the ground, very stocky. See Bigfoot ran in for the takedown, almost got knocked over by Hunt. It's like running into a wall there and Mark Hunt Trying to, trying to work his way in. And you see Bigfoot continuing to alternate stances. Two minutes down in the opening round. Hunt presses forward, and as you'd expect, Bigfoot covers up immediately. Down goes Hunt. 
It was Bigfoot Silva who got the better of that exchange. Mark Hunt right back to his feet here in front of us. And the crowd going nuts as Hunt gets back upright. Cannot sleep on the striking skills of Bigfoot Silva. That is a huge man. All takes is one shot here in the heavyweight division. Bigfoot landed a beautiful right hand. And of course, he had Hunt on the canvas and was unable to keep him there. Back to the southpaw stance now is Bigfoot. And that's what we were talking about earlier. A beautiful scramble for Mark Hunt. Has really worked on that. And this is a tighter Mark Hunt. Appears to be in phenomenal shape for this five rounder here tonight. Leg kick lands flush for Hunt. Bigfoot doing a nice job following up that front kick with a right hand. Yeah, he's used that teep right hand a few times in this fight. Trying to get some respect from Mark Hunt in the striking department here. And Mark Hunt still tentative and still trying to figure out a way to get on the inside here without getting taken down, and that's the dilemma. And Bigfoot doing a nice job keeping those hands high. Nice job by Hunt to prevent the takedown and reverse Bigfoot up against the fence. Beautiful job by Hunt to get underhooks here against Bigfoot. Now he's pressuring Bigfoot up against the cage. Bigfoot's gonna have to watch out off the break. And we get separation once again. Strong body kick there by Silva, and for Mark Hunt, at least, small sample size, but the takedown defense has been there early. Stop. Good work, man. Let's take a look at that right hand, that drop, Mark Hunt. There it is, just a short right. Caught him right on the chin. Hunt landed a big shot in that exchange as well, but Silva saw his chin hold up. You know, when they were in front of us, John, you could see the thickness of the ankle of Mark Hunt. It's unbelievable to see. It looks as thick as my thigh. That guy is built to fight. That K1 World Grand Prix Championship all the way back in 2001 as Hunt presses forward, but defensively, Bigfoot Silva's ready. Yeah, he's making very sure to keep those hands high. Hunt almost landed with that left hook there. And the leg kick buckles the lead leg of Mark Hunt there. Yeah, I really like what Bigfoot's doing from this righty stance. He's trying to beat up that lead, lead leg of Mark Hunt. And he's mixing in some very nice front kicks as well to the body. Hunt continuing to press forward. And Bigfoot Silva able to elude that advance there. Now it's Silva coming forward. Bigfoot sensing an opportunity here. But once again, Hunt able to scramble out. You notice the sense of urgency. As soon as Mark Hunt had his back to the cage, Bigfoot immediately attacked. Definitely has been a part of his strategy in the past. He gets very aggressive once he has his opponents back to the cage. Often looks for an opportunity to land a big combination and take his opponent down. He missed on that back kick, though. Well, there is a clear composure and confidence in Mark Hunt here tonight. Nice body shot there for Mark Hunt. Leave that 
Both fighters biding their time. Bigfoot once again going upstairs with the kick. That is partially checked by Hunt. Swing and a miss there for Silva. And that right hand almost connected from Mark Hunt. There's a nice right hand from Mark Hunt that backed Bigfoot Silva up and hurt him. Might have been his most significant strike of the fight. See Mark Hunt go to the body again because that's allowing him to land some shots and get Bigfoot to duck down and maybe set up a, a cross right there like he did earlier and possibly an uppercut. And thus far, we've had primarily a striking battle. The takedown not there for Bigfoot Silva. John Anna, Kenny Florian in Brisbane, Australia. Good to have you with us. It is UFC Fight Night here on Fox Sports 1. Beautiful body kick from Mark Hunt. Right to the left side of the ribs of Bigfoot Silva. There's a nice front kick from Bigfoot. I'm surprised that Bigfoot isn't landing that or trying for that switch kick, that lead switch kick to the head against Mark Hunt. Hunt is really holding that right hand very low, surely in an attempt to stop the takedowns and get underhooks, but he's gonna have to be careful against Bigfoot because he can get upstairs with those kicks. I'm trying to get inside, sticking and moving. And again, Bigfoot continues to work on that lead leg. That hurt Mark Hunt. And that's now you see Hunt going to the southpaw side. Yeah, that's a kick that Benson Henderson really likes to use. Instead of going to the thigh, he goes right to the side of the calf there. And it makes it very, very painful to walk. And you can see Mark Hunt switch his stance. That has definitely taken its toll on Mark Hunt. Just one or two of those. And Mark Hunt has switched his stance now. 10 seconds, gentlemen. Yeah, that is a serious foot. Connecting to the bone on the shin of Mark Hunt. Into the red corner. Yeah. Mr. Water. Breathe, Mark. Breathe. 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 Breathe, Mark. Yeah, let me wash it. Yeah. yeah. Mark, you got to beat his low kick, otherwise he's going to hammer it all day. Mark, when he switch southpaw, it's a good opportunity to fake up high and drill the right hand, do the solar plexus to set up left hook. Okay, Here's that kick. That one was a little higher. That wasn't the one that got him to limp back to his corner, though. That was the one. That's the one right there. Mark Hunt switched his stance and limped back to his corner. Devastating leg kick from Bigfoot Silva. Okay, you ready? You ready, Red? Clear this to the Come on, gentlemen. So a little limp there out of Mark Hunt as we begin our middle round. And I was happy to hear the corner of Mark Hunt ask him to go to the body with that right hand. Especially works extremely well when a guy is trying to level change. Nice combination from Hunt. Really a technical fight here between former training partners. And how about Mark Hunt with a takedown? Look at this, and almost in a side control. Mark Hunt with another Mark takedown. Bigfoot warm for grabbing the fence there. We talked about the development of his grappling skills, and who would have thought a takedown attempt from Mark Hunt would have occurred here in the third round, and nice way to mix things up for Mark Hunt. As he tries to keep Antonio Silva guessing. Oh. 
So certainly the speed advantage for Mark Hunt has been on display. And the strength right there to stay upright. He's got such a low center of gravity, excellent balance, and as you mentioned, a whole lot of strength. Bigfoot tried to trip, and I thought he was gonna hit it, but Mark Hunt showing how good his base is. Bigfoot almost fell, fell over. Mark Hunt has always been an adaptable fighter, forced to make some adjustments here as Bigfoot throws the kick. Bigfoot still trying to attack that outside of the calf of Mark Hunt, and you can see him really walking very, very gingerly there. Ooh, there's that uppercut from Mark Hunt that almost landed. Well, that right hand certainly landed, but Bigfoot eats it like a grinder. Under three minutes now in the third round. And a little cut on the forehead of Antonio Silva. Not sure if they collided heads there at one point. You can see Bigfoot was wincing. A lot of action here in the clinch now. Hunt with a nifty trip and a right hand. Huge right hand for Mark Hunt. Straight right for Mark Hunt, Bigfoot's in trouble. Mark Hunt trying to finish things off in the guard of Bigfoot Silva. A right hand dropped him. Bigfoot Silva trying to survive here out of his closed guard. Now open guard as Mark Hunt tries to pass. Plenty of time on the clock here. Allowed him here as Mark Hunt tries to finish this fight. The arena is shaking and Mark Hunt is pouring it on. Those are some brutal elbows as well, John. Now he's in half guard. He's got to be careful in the half guard of Bigfoot Silva. He's very good from this position and getting back to his feet and sweeping. Mark Hunt is on to it though. He's keeping his underhook in place. His left underhook is keeping the hips. A Bigfoot flat on the mat, and Mark Hunt, short shot after short shot on that head of Bigfoot Silva. Well, and you have to love the conditioning of Mark Hunt here in the third round. as he continues to work on Antonio Silva. And you gotta think this is taking a lot out of the former number one contender. An elbow lands with conviction. Mark Hunt may have broken the nose of Bigfoot Silva on that right hand. And those short hammer fists and elbows aren't helping that at all. <laughs> so for the better part of two minutes, Antonio Silva has been dealing with a Mark Hunt onslaught. And it continues. 10 seconds, gentlemen. Man, the accuracy of Mark Hunt. Whoa! Let's take a look at that right hand from Mark Hunt, right down the middle. This is true. Right between the guard of Bigfoot Silva and dropped him. Where is it? Where is it? The guy didn't let it put in. Sit down. Sit down. Sit down and relax his legs. Lose, lose, keep fought. You've got to be the one, man. Keep the game plan. You've got to keep the game plan. That's all what you need. <laughs> what an atmosphere here in Brisbane. Okay, you ready? Ready? Come on, let's smash it up. And you got to admire the work ethic of Mark Hunt. Looks like he could go 10 rounds here tonight.
He is in a fourth round in the UFC for the first time. Another heavy leg kick from Bigfoot Silva to the outside of the calf of Mark Hunt. But now Mark Hunt landing shots and backing Bigfoot Silva up. And Both men are very sweaty here, John, which is going to be an advantage for Mark Hunt, who's trying to avoid this takedown. And Bigfoot is visibly fatigued. He needs a takedown in the worst way. You can see swelling now to the outside of that left calf of Mark Hunt. And there's another kick from Bigfoot. So Bigfoot digging deep here. Big right hand there for Silva. Bigfoot's got to be careful that he doesn't get countered on those big shots. And look at this. Hunt's going to go for the double here. He's got to lock hands. And Mark Hunt just too agile. Huge takedown for Hunt. Unbelievable. Another takedown for Mark Hunt against Bigfoot Silva. You know, we all said if the fight hits the mat, Bigfoot Silva's gonna have the big advantage. How wrong we were, Mark Hunt out grappling the Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu black belt, Bigfoot Silva. Well, this sport is long on unpredictability. And Mark Hunt has got it all going here tonight. Look at this arm lock attempt from Bigfoot here. Mark Hunt has the cage that can save him here. And Bigfoot bails on that attempt. Three plus minutes with which to work now in round four. It is so difficult when you're on your back and you have your head pinned up against that cage, which really acts like a cheese grater. It's so tough to get your hips going. And a nice shot by Bigfoot Silva there to get upright. What a fight it has been so far, and we have separation once again. Oh, big stiff right hand there for Mark Hunt. Bigfoot, excellent job of getting back to his feet here, up against the cage. Trying to chip away again on that leg. A Bigfoot, what a devastating elbow from Mark Hunt. Another one. Oh, and Bigfoot is wearing it now. Huge shots being landed on both sides. Some crazy exchanges here. And Hunt's got to be careful. Big knee by Silva. Oh, Mark Hunt's got to be careful. Here comes Bigfoot. Bigfoot landing heavy shots here. Mark Hunt not responding back. Bigfoot Silva rallying in the fourth. There's that left hand from Hunt and another one. Bigfoot's hurt here. But he lands on top. We'll see. He doesn't have the strength to keep him there. What a round. Unbelievable exchanges. Now Bigfoot on top. Well, Bigfoot smelling blood in the water, but you got to be mindful of that gas tank. This fight is insane. So many momentum shifts now with Bigfoot on top here. And Hunt now trying to get back to his feet. Bigfoot trying to pin the head of Mark Hunt. Bigfoot trying to posture up. A finish could happen on both sides at any moment. And look at the size of those paws of Bigfoot Silva. Must be like getting hit with a, with a lunchbox here as he moves into mount now. And Mark Hunt's chin is holding up, but Bigfoot continues to land. Oh, and that one opened him up. Yeah, big elbow now. Oh, Mark Hunt's in a lot of trouble, Kenny. He's got 30 seconds now to survive this round. What, what resolve by Bigfoot Silva to change the scope of this round. Hunt is fighting back now. He's trying to get back to half guard. What heart from Mark Hunt. Bigfoot trying to load up on that right hand again. 10 seconds to go. And Bigfoot content to let the round ride out. Stand and cheer, ladies and gentlemen. Woo! What a round. 
Unreal. There's that shot from Bigfoot Silva that really hurt Mark Hunt. There's brilliant exchanges from both men here. And look at this barrage from Bigfoot Silva. Yeah, and then the elbow. Yep. Right there, John, just split his forehead wide open. A tremendous outpouring of support for these two fighters who deserve every ounce of it. Mark Hunt and Antonio Silva. They exchange a pleasantry and will decide this thing in the final five minutes. Beautiful one-two for Mark Hunt and a beautiful right hand. Oh, so is Hartley. This fight is ridiculous, and we still have four plus minutes in this and fight. Bigfoot somehow still has the wherewithal, Kenny, to change stances there. Hunt continues to land to start the fifth. Another big right hand. Wow. That left hook hurt Bigfoot, and then another one. It's Mark Hunt who's getting the better of these exchanges now in tight as oh. Bigfoot tries to attempt the takedown. Uh, Mark Hunt, Mark Hunt's underhooks prevent that. Well, this is a fight they'll be talking about for some time, at least at this point. Mark Hunt appears to be the fresher fighter. A classic, and Bigfoot is exhausted, John. And that elbow just split the head of Bigfoot Silva. Left hook for Mark Hunt. Another one. And a third. And the crowd goes nuts as Mark Hunt slips away. Short, crisp elbow on the inside. Oh, Bigfoot's wobbly now. Mark Hunt trying to finish it in the fifth round. Another short elbow from Mark Hunt. Now a body shot. Bigfoot trying to clinch. And how much more can Silva take? Oh, Mark Hunt in the fifth round. There are not many men alive who can take these shots from Mark Hunt. And Bigfoot has done it again and again. That is not a stoppage. They will look at the cut of Bigfoot Silva. That's too much, bro. I just can't see what it is. I don't think it's that bad. So interesting decision there by Steve Percival. He takes a look at the cut. Perhaps a much needed breather on both sides. We resume. Mark Hunt repeatedly looking for that short elbow on the inside against Bigfoot as he charges forward. There it was again. It was blocked by Bigfoot. Nice jab from Hunt. Look at the calmness of Mark Hunt on the inside, John. How he's just picking his shots in a very dangerous spot against Bigfoot Silva. This is the striking experience of Mark Hunt that's really getting in the better shot, but now look at Bigfoot trying to get a knock out of his own. Exhaustion on both sides, but Bigfoot still trying to finish this fight. Two minutes now to go in our fifth and final round. We are witnessing one of the best fights of the year, John. Certainly a late candidate in that discussion here in 2013. And now Bigfoot putting his hands together. Hunt with a huge counter. Oh, what an elbow. And another one. Huge knee by Bigfoot. Bigfoot using all the energy he can to try to clinch, but it's not there. 
What a gutty performance by both of these elite heavyweights. The fans just going sick here in Brisbane. Hard to imagine having more respect for two professional athletes than you do right now for Mark Hunt and Bigfoot Silva. Bigfoot trying to get control of that tight clinch and drive up a knee into the face of Mark Hunt. Mark Hunt trying a dirty box here and has to be careful. Bigfoot emptying the gas tank here, trying to put a combination together. Ten seconds and counting in one of the greatest heavyweight fights we have ever witnessed inside the octagon. Whoa! Mark Hunt and Antonio Silva. Bigfoot Silva and Mark Hunt, thank you for that performance. That was insane. A great show of sportsmanship and respect after the fact. Both guys refusing to be finished despite absorbing obvious punishment at the hands of the other. Incredible main event here in Brisbane. Man, it started with Bigfoot trying to take out that lead leg of Mark Hunt. He went to the thigh, he went to the calf. You saw Mark Hunt limp back to his stool at one point. We, th we thought that was gonna slow down Mark Hunt, but no, it did not. Right hand after right hand landed on the face of Bigfoot Silva. Excellent grounded pound from Bigfoot Silva. He tried to get Mark Hunt out of there on the ground, and look at these combinations from Mark Hunt. Those elbows, brutal elbows from Mark Hunt on the inside against Bigfoot Silva. Exchange after exchange, so many momentum shifts in this one, John. I don't even know what to say after this one. Well, the crowd and the UFC fighters here in the building are just watching in awe. Mark Hunt and Antonio Silva, no losers in this one. We will get to the official decision when we return to Brisbane. What a main event, Silva and Hunt. Stay with us, this is UFC Fight Night. Queensland, Australia, this is UFC Fight Night, Hunt versus Bigfoot. Ladies and gentlemen, after five rounds, we go to the judges' scorecards for a decision. The judges score the contest, 48, 47, Hunt. The next two judges score the contest, 47, 47, and 47, 47. This fight is considered a majority draw. One of the best fights we have seen inside this octagon, Mark Hunt and Antonio.